it was, you know, it was kind of weird. You know, it's like I heard somebody, you know, pounding on the door. I was wondering what they were pounding for. So when I opened the door, there was a friend of mine that I know. I thought he was playing, you know, playing games, you know. You know what I mean? But, yeah, I guess when I looked through the back, I seen the fireman, and he's yelling, you know, get out. You know, it's a fire. So when I looked, I seen all the smoke. And we all just got dressed. We just woke up, got dressed, and ran, you know what I mean? It was just run, go, grab, you know, the wiener dog and get out because the smoke was thick and you couldn't really see. The firemen were banging on the windows. So there's in that situation, there's not much time to think. No, God bless it. We haven't had any injuries, no firefighters injured and no residents injured. Um, we're very fortunate, especially with how icy the fire scene was this morning. Well, it's a major impact with the businesses that were in there, and uh, we, we hope that we can get this situation taken care of and get businesses up and started again. That's our, and right now we have the power out in a lot of businesses because part of fighting the fire, we had to shut the power down, and we don't have our power back up for our businesses that remain on, on West Main Street. So.